What is up, everyone, and welcome back to GPS PNR 20 and 20 Russia episode 14. Oh boy, I really am just going to abbreviate it from now on because it's just too much to say the full title, guys. I'm I'm sorry, but you're just going to be hearing abbreviations from me. All right, so as we were, we're still um, essentially fixing up our economy. As per viewer request, our next target for conflict will actually be the Ukraine. I just hope that we can pull a lightning strike. We'd have to stage our forces right here in Brinyskia, Brinyanyaskia. If I'm butchering that, I'm sorry if there's any uh, uh, Slavic or Russians in the chat. Please uh, correct me if I'm pronouncing that right or wrong. I do not know. I'm not Russian. I'm actually English by descent, so, you know, it's, hey, well, that's damn dirty Brits, yeah? Well, we can't fucking pronounce shit now, can we? Brisbane International Airport, okay. All right, so fixing our economy. We got to first take a look at our currency and see how we're, oh, look at that. See, inflation fucking tanking is what we want. Look at that. It's going down, 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 down. All right, so we are still in a deficit. That's right, because I did do all those, um, oh, what was I believe it was the industry that we privatized. So I want to take, go ahead and take a look at that in the parliament, see when that law is going, what the fuck is this shit? How did it get rejected? Wait, what? Proposed on three twenty, rejected on four six. Laws in, okay, law in progress. Oh, okay, here we go. I was gonna say, what the fuck happened here? <laughs> rejected. I'm like, I thought I had full fucking control. What happened here? Laws in progress. Here we go. Okay, so the seventeenth. Yeah, so that's the nationalization. All right. Uh. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and close that. So we got a little time to play with. Of course, to get out of the deficit, I could always just, you know, raise tax on the industrial section and that'll put us right out of it. But I wanna avoid doing that at all costs, if at all possible. So let's see what else we can do here. I don't really wanna do anything while we're in a deficit until it pops out of it. So we'll just go ahead and speed the time up. The, uh Liberation, okay, Minister of Justice, Justice threatens our course of action. I probably really should start looking into them. Oh, we got a meeting with India. Okay, cool. Moscow Film Festival, we will accept and take that. Okay, we liberated the uh, pesky protesters. So I hope everyone's doing extremely well. So it's been quite a, quite a week. Conflict the against the Union. Yeah, okay, yeah. Those damn pacifist terrorists, you know, god dang it, they're friggin' terrorists by being peaceful and everything, how dare they? Damn pacifist, whatever shall we do with them? Ban them and arrest their leader, that's what I say. Which will come later on, holy crap, okay, hold on, stop, 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 stop. They will transfer After privatizing this sector, it will be hard to say right- Oh, okay, so... That went through. Oops, I didn't mean to close my secret service there. Do we still have it? Private sector reform, uprising in Moscow, president of Azerbaijan. I didn't come. You want, oh, you want to purchase milk. Okay. Um, yeah, we do have a little bit of a, but you want to purchase it 346. All right, dude, can we talk you up a little bit more on your pricing, huh? How about 372? No, 320? Okay. He is willing to negotiate. 368. 365. Ooh, will you do three? How about 347? Just make it an easy 347. Okay, they accepted it. Slightly a little bit above their purchase price, way below our sale price. So that I would say is a very good 
bargain, and that will also help with the employment. Thank you, no sir. No thanks. My ulcer can't take it. Oh, I'm sorry for your ulcer, good sir. All right. Advisor, where was that? Oh, here we are. Director of Intelligence, Effective Security Services. Have your security services operational and competent. Okay, well, that's good. Law has been passed. Public sector reform. Internet service. Yeah, I know. Uprising in Moscow. Yeah, we'll take care of that After right now. After privatizing this sector, it will be hard to say right away whether we will come. Trust me, it'll be fine. And this is in Moscow, United Powers of the Public Service. Eh, this will be easy. No, oh, I don't want the military. <laughs> we'll just get you right here. Get you right here. Actually, probably throw it right there. We'll go ahead and get you guys. Go right here. All right, there we go. Hit play. All right, so they're all arrested. That dude's arrested. All right, let's go ahead and get in here. They're arrested. All right, okay, easy. Public finances, boom. Now let's see what happened. Look at that, 24% excess of our GDP. Look at that shit. Woo, we just got some monies to spend. Look at that, see? Look at that. All right, uprising subdued. See? <laughs> we have subdued the rebel movement. Yes, we have. And I don't want you to murder anybody. All right, wow. Oops, sorry, the mic bump there. I actually bought a arm stand for my microphone and, you know, all the good stuff for it. So I'm still trying getting used to where I have it placed. You might see me bump it a time or two. Okay, then. Wow, we have a huge, huge budget excess. Look at that. At least almost double. Not that we're going to go and spend all of it, but $876 billion of our budget excess. So we got like $400 billion. I mean... So, there is uh, quite a lot of things we can do. That I don't know. I wasn't even expecting that big of a boost, to be honest. Um, wow. Do we have elections coming up? No, we're not. We do not have elections coming up. Okay, Russia, we are now financially secure. So, you know what? As my first act... Why is the tax on consumption rates fixed to stay all European Union countries? Yeah, well, we're not part of the European Union. So you know what? We're going to give the nice people a generous tax break. Because why not? I'll keep the high bracket up here. But this is definitely going to put more spending. In fact, we'll lower it down to 9%. We're going to put some more money in our people's pockets so everything else could stay safe. i think we can probably actually lower the value added tax too let's take a poll on this what's the opinion of the people they love it all right we'll go ahead and push that through and it's value added tax that's kind of like in, in the united states if you guys you know if you live here or have ever been here or planning on to some a lot of states have what we call a sales tax so that's money that actually goes onto the to the state whenever you purchase something. So that's kind of the same thing to put in perspective. Uh, I don't know what it is in whatever country you might be watching this from, but it's it, I believe it's essentially the same thing. If I'm wrong, you can go ahead and correct uh, correct me on that. So wow, I was not expecting that huge of a of a bump. Well, you know what that means? We can actually go and, and definitely upgrade some projects for damn sure. We'll go ahead and pop some money into there. Now, I'm not going to go and spend all of our money. I don't want to... No. <laughs> uh, High-speed train, hyperloop line, subway line. Hence traffic airport. So basically, we, we don't have... We only have three traffic subway lines. 
main highway, secondary highways. We're still building a lot of highway, so. Regulate speed, established stock of automatic radars. Yeah, they're okay with that. All right, let's go ahead and get some more automatic radars. Establish a minimum wage. Oh crap, they actually don't like that. Okay, let's not do that. <laughs> Blood alcohol. Yoing. <laughs> Everybody could be drunk driving and shit. Uh, self-driving vehicles. Allow testing of self-driving highway total ban. Yeah, you know what? We'll go ahead and allow that. What's the people? Oh, okay, they actually hate self-driving. Wow. Uh, construction budget. All right, we'll go ahead and... We don't have any more dilapidated housing. But let's go ahead and build some new housing. How about that? That'll also take care of our unemployment. Here, we'll build... I don't want to eat up all of our, our employment, so... Here, how about we build 20,000 new houses? That'll eat up half our manpower to allocate. That sounds good. All right, we'll build 20,000 brand new houses. And let's see, what else can we do here? What else, what else, what else can we do? Work. Legislation. Oh, there goes my phone again. I forgot. Every single time I forget to turn this damn thing off. Nothing interesting anyway. My phone never has anything interesting to say to me, guys. Never. No one calls me. I'm so lonely. If I give you my number, will you guys call me, please? Or everybody? Guys and, you know, gals and whatever you identify yourself as. <laughs> All right, don't worry, guys. I'm, I'm not getting political in a political simulator. Trust me. I, I don't really actually have time to deal with all that nonsense. I stay out of it. All right, you know what? I feel like our our police deserve a bonus, so and a lot more manpower for damn sure. And uh, bump up, God! I'm gonna actually end up going and spending all of our. No, we're not gonna spend all of it, but we are gonna bump up some much needed infrastructure. Uh, I do want public safety to be maxed out. Criminal Investigation Squad, we need that max. Uh, Securities and Exchange Commissions. Okay, let's go ahead and drop 31 bill for that. And I also want to do, where is, would it be under Health, Red Prevention, ICU bed? Yeah, see, ICU beds, medical generator. Yeah, I'm pretty sure, like, that recession we went through is because I think the game is still programmed to go through um, COVID, even though, you know, you really don't, you know, have it. Here, we'll give our, our hospital staff a nice raise. How about give them some more spending money? There you go. This will be basically like our own little stimulus package. Like, okay, everybody gets a little bit more funding here. Because we has the monies. Services for the handicap. We're going to go prevention and vaccination still. Back that all the way up. We're going to go. There. Oh, definitely. Okay, let's max that out right there. All right. Can, oops. Didn't need that. Let's go ahead and confirm that. We're still at 19% excess. But we still got some money to play around with. Uh, definitely research. Oh god, our poor researchers aren't getting paid shit. All right, let's give these poor guys man, with the conditions that they're working in and everything. And we'll go ahead and bump the research up for everything. Get our research going all right let's go ahead and confirm that we need buildings objective actual oh. 
how long is this? This is supposed to only take five months, and yet it's still taking a long ass time. All right, so let's. We're gonna build 494 more. That'll be done in a month. Because they were complaining about uh, space issues. So hopefully that will help a little bit. Uh, let's see here. What else can we do? Uh, we'll go gender equality. Move that up a little bit because I do believe everybody should be treated equal in the workplace. I am a strong believer of that. Whether you're regardless of what gender you are born with or identify as, you're a human being and you are capable of doing <clears throat> anything a human being can do. Unless you say you're an alien and I don't know what to say. <laughs> I can't help you on that one. All right, so well, shit. You know, maybe, uh, maybe now that we're out of this economic depression. Oh, that's right. I wonder if we should continue building our oil. We got a lot of oil down here. I wonder if we could build some over here. Those are solar plants. Oh, are we on electricity? That's another thing. Energy. So we have a production cap, national consumption. Let's see if we can dismantle some of these uh, power plants. Not that many. Um, but let's go with uh, 65 terawatts. We'll go ahead and start dismantling those. That should still give us... Uh-oh. Ooh, ooh, I may mean, have screwed up. I hope, we're, I hope I didn't... Crap, I think I screwed up. <laughs> well, it says we're out of uh, 72 electrical surplus, so I hope I didn't just screw that up. Otherwise, we're in trouble. I may have just fucked the sun up. Electrical shortages. All right. Oil wells are still being built. Uh, let's see what we can build over on this side. Maybe we have more oil over here we can build. Oh shit, that's dismantled. No, I don't want to dismantle anything. Uh, position. How are we over here? Very weak. Okay. So there's really no oil over here near the Caspian Sea. There's some oil right here in this region. I mean, it's average, it's not great, but it's still something. Yeah, okay, so it's average oil. Okay, very weak. What if we build, um, what about oil platforms? Maybe there's oil in the ocean? Average, okay, so there, there's definitely some oil in the oceans here. Very weak. Very weak. Very weak. But where the fuck did I just see average at? What the hell? Is it out here? Okay, so average. Average. So literally we can only probably squeeze in about two. Oh, screw it. Let's see if I can... It's average, but it's still, you know, it's still something. Okay, average. See if we can get one more average. Okay. There we go. How about gas? Let's see here. Maybe gas is good over here? Very weak. Uh, uh, we really don't have much in terms of actual. What over here? Is there any gas line over here? Very weak. How about in this section? Oh, okay. Here we go.
Okay, we have good production along right here for some gas lines. Good. We get very good. Okay, so there seems to be gas pretty much in this section right up here. How about over here? Good. Can we get very good? What about over here? Peak. Average. Okay, so gas is it's pretty much like right here in this section. So, all right, let's go ahead and start building some gas wells then. Plop one right there. We'll go, there's two. Three. Four. And five. And you know what, just to um just for good measure because i'm pretty sure i got rid of more than i should have uh how long will a nuclear power plant take to build one year four months at nine thousand and power 67 67 billion dollars How about a offshore wind? 12 billion in three months. All right, we'll do that. We'll go ahead and get a, another offshore wind over here just in case I may have whoopsie on the power. Come on, give me at least a good average. Average, okay. Um, okay, how about down here? How's the production in the Black Sea? Still average? All right, here, we'll go ahead and get two um, offshores down over here. There we go. All right, construction. We need to make some more trade contracts too. Oh, pipeline in progress. Start building. Start building a gas pipeline. That's what we need to do. All right, so that's an oil platform. Oh, we can't link it up to an oil platform. Okay, fine. Cancel then. Screw you, buddy. Oh, now where was I building those infrastructure and energy? Oh, here we are. Here's the gas pipelines. That's an oil well. So I do want to build a gas pipeline. Connect that up. Something. Uh, start building a gas pipeline. We'll start from right up here. Go there. Go there. There, go there. Oh, that's an oil. That's a gas pipeline. I can connect it up to this one. Or I can connect it up to this one. This is actually a gas pipeline as well. All right. There we go. We'll connect that up and confirm. And I don't want to spend too much money or manpower on it there. All right. I, <laughs> I think that should do pretty damn good for infrastructure. That should do pretty, pretty well, actually. All right. I guess we'll start eyeballing up Ukraine. Um, for shit. Do I have, where's my satellites? Uh, security, health, research, automobile. Oh, really? Because of the stupid automobile shit? Oh, I must have glitched out. 
Oh God, what the hell? And it's always all the churches too. Why is it always just these churches that protest? I, I don't understand. We have another Good meeting. Morning. Oh, this is a meeting from India. You want to sail us some beef. Kind of a weird trade coming from India. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's pretty weird coming from India. I mean, I guess we could up our production a little bit. We could subsidize a little bit more and up our production. Uh, let's see if I can lowball you about a hundred thousand. Nope. Okay. Well, I don't want your beef then. Sure. Oh lordy. They always try to do something to help the people, and they always stand up and say, "Hey, hey fuck you." Well, at least they're all in one fucking spot. Come on, get in there, you. And they're all running around like chickens with their heads cut off. Oh, well, this should be relatively easy. Very relatively easy. There we go. He's arrested. They're all arrested. I don't believe there's anybody else on the map. Nope, this is it. Just this one little spot. Oh, God. Why is the military getting involved? We have subdued the rep. I do not tell the damn military to get involved. Why do they get involved in shit? I tell them not to do something, and they automatically do it. I guess when they take the courts or everything, then it becomes a personal issue. All right, everybody into the court building. Come on. All right. That's enough for that. We have subdued the... Really? One guy? That's it? Just one guy? One measly little guy? And you're arrested. Oh, no, I guess not. Now he's in the police station, too. And you're arrested. All right. That takes care of over here. I'm sure there's more over here. Yes, there we is. Two the damn Satanist. All right. We'll go ahead and just clobber these guys real quick. Oh, what? You throwing Molotovs at me, dude? There. The cha. Over. We have subdued the rest. Okay. Uh, this is the uh, yeah yeah um yeah uh yeah yeah. <laughs> oh my God! Twenty five percent hit from that. Jesus Christ! All right, all right. It's okay. I'm not too overly concerned about it. Although I did want to start prepping for Ukraine, but now I can't do that because of the damn effing uprisings. Someone's like, oh, hey, here's your 100% bonus. Oh, here, now it's gone. Like that According to you. Ooh, rain dismantled. I'm the rebels have stopped. Yeah, of course they stopped the rioters. fighters. The rioters have taken control of the square. Well, if you hurry up and get your asses in there. Just chew them away. Maintain control. We have subdued the rebel movement. All right. I know I just saw my satellite right there. All right. Let's go ahead and get this over, over into the Ukraine. At least start making preparations for that. Here comes our satellite. Ooh, France had a disaster, a volcano eruption. That's not good. Uprising in Moscow. Uprising, uprising, uprisings. Yes, we don't care about the damn uprisings. 
Just don't, guys. We. Ooh. Do I spy on Washington? Yeah, sure. Why not? <laughs> like, why do you have a satellite? God, how many satellites do we? God, that's, we have a lot of freaking satellites. Holy shit! What? Jesus. Why do we have so many? Oh my lord, that is a lot of satellites. Holy crap. Now what? Oh, not this dude again. Please. And why not? Yes. Could you throw? Well, I don't know what to do for you, dude. I know you're protesting because I used the fucking military. Ugh. Can I... How about if I know, because you're the head of a union, I could arrest you. I could just plain out fucking arrest your ass. Oh god, this is hurting my freaking rating. Stop protesting, you bastards. 7%. Damn it. Strike. Okay, strike's over. Hope you all got what you wanted to out of that, because now, now Shibby's pissed. Electricity production, health response. Okay. I right, see, now we're back up to 100%. And more riots. Good God. Alright, guys. Um, so... Interesting episode to say the least. It's like every time I do things that are good, obviously. I mean, security, auto. What the hell is the automobile? I don't ever. I didn't even put it through. It must have been the freaking bug. Like, if you click on pull, sometimes it freaking puts it through. Our electric instruments are terribly understaffed. We should take this opportunity to roll. Yeah, but God, I cannot read. The development of electric cars on a large scale, which will increase the demand for electricity and cleaning. The earth in our city is it um okay so then where oh where will you tell me where in god's name earth do i do i Purchase and start for electric frickin' cars, man. Because I don't see it anywhere. No, it's not in service. I know for damn sure it's not in service. Oh, we went from 24 to 13%. All right, well. <laughs> the rioters. That takes care of our spending spree for right now. Yeah, I know. All this troubles, uprisings, and everything like that. I will go ahead and take care of all of that shit off camera. So when you guys come back, you will not have to deal with all this crap that is uh, bestowing upon us. And that was the last of our legislation that went through. So... There should not be any more riots after that, at least I assure you. I hope not. We are back up to 100%, which means we are in a fail favorable position to start a war with Ukraine. Although, like I said, I do want to kind of take care of home first before we go and integrate another country. Uh, you know, make sure our electricity is up to date. Make sure everything is good, that we don't have any of these fucking riots popping up in the middle of everything while we're trying to do something. So, just all that good stuff, you know. You gotta settle things internally, like I keep saying, before we go off and go on a conquest. Well, those are gonna be kind of weird, having a piece of land up here, then down here. But I guess we can cave across the middle right here. Then I'll integrate all this as part of our Russian Empire. As we slowly, slowly move to the west. Uh, also, guys, let me know if you want me to just up and leave the UN. I mean, naturally, if I do that, then... You know, World War III will be intimate. Of course, I can't guarantee I'll win it. They might kick me. More than likely, they're probably going to kick me out of office before any uh, desirable uh, result is obtained. But we could possibly do a uh, first uh, strike over here with our Navy and then 
you know, hurry up and mop through all the cities with our our forces. We'll see. I just kind of wish, like, I just wish I could get Ukraine to just declare war on me. I really wish I do. Maybe if I violate their territory, you know, that might do it. But I'm not sure, you know, because then it'll be looking at me as like omni aggressor and yeah. But we'll see, guys. We will see. But until we then, we shall be heading off now. So thank you all, my, all of you so, so much for watching. Please be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to ring that little bell so you get notified of all the latest uploads. And be sure, as always, to stay safe out there and stay swag. I will see you all in the next one. Thank you.